Hi, what a signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we are going to find out how does your person on your mind feel about you since they last saw you. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. Today is the 19th, 19th of March, 2023. Time here in Genoa, Italy is 10.44 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for uh, water signs. And if you were to finally got it to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same water sign. All right, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio their person on your mind how do they feel about them since they last saw them please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person there'll be a lot of details in this reading where it's not going to resonate with you from the beginning till the end so just take what resonates with you all right still a little bit sick so <laughs> please bear with me thank you so much for all of your support don't forget to hit like share and subscribe okay we've got the queen of pentacles in love first so your person on your mind could be a virgo capcom or a taurus could also be a fire sign aries sagittarius leo definitely strong I am seeing Pisces here, Scorpio here, Libra, Gemini, Christ can be any sign. All the signs are here, okay? So we've got the Tower, King of Wands in reverse, and the Flower Cups. Ooh, and then we've got the Death card here as well. So it does feel like something unexpected may have happened between the two of you, the Tower in reverse. They could be feeling disappointed, sad, because I think, okay, this is a reading for a lot of you. I feel like this is a reading where you and this person are separated okay because of the tower and the death here and a lot of disappointment i'm sensing here if it's not a separation it could be an indication of something that may have happened unexpectedly okay because the tower again can indicate something that was shocking unexpected so maybe the last time they saw you they were kind of shocked hmm they were kind of shocked and they, it led them to feeling disappointed with the five of cups they could be disappointed because you unless maybe you could be embodying the king of wands here in reverse who knows again it could go vice versa but they could be disappointed because you you didn't show enough passion towards them or that you sh maybe you weren't very interested in some way shape or form so that piqued their interest with the page of wands here hmm. some of you could be in the same general relationship not all of you but i do sense pisces cancer and scorpio that your person feels like i'm hearing pushing they feel like you were pushing them away because of the queen of swords here you may have cut them off told them something very unexpectedly that I feel could have been very shocking or sudden. They didn't maybe it feel like they didn't expect you to say these things to them. Or to look the way you looked, okay? So with the high priestess here, they could be feeling that okay. Pisces Cancer and Scorpio, they're not interested or that they they just told me gave they just gave me a piece of their mind or that it could be their own intuition with the high persist here they could be getting certain signals from you through their own intuition that you may have been a bit cold because the queen of swords is a very cold energy right if you're embodying the queen of swords unless again roles are being reversed here either it could go vice versa either they feel like you are being very cold towards them or you were very friendly towards them. Either way, it's unexpected for them, okay? Six of Pentacles here is a reverse. Like you don't want to talk to them. Or that you 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 acted very coldly towards them, or that you didn't want to talk to them. 
And like six of the wands could be sitting on your high horse or showing off a little bit. Um, like you don't care about them. But they feel like you did that deliberately. I don't know why I'm getting this like... See, the page of wands is facing the six of wands while the six of wands is looking towards the right. So they could be feeling like they want to talk to you nicely, but then you you didn't talk to them back, that you didn't reply them, or that you you didn't, or that you could be ignoring them, or told them off, or seem really really cold. Unless it's vice versa, where they feel like they had to be cold towards you, like they had to ignore you, give you silent treatment. To show that they are like six of ones, like as though they're better than you, they're better than that, that kind of an energy, okay? It could go vice versa. So something that is not equal between two of you, six of pentacles and whatever, since you last saw each other. I feel like something was one-sided, okay? Either it was you who was eager to talk to them, but then they just couldn't be bothered, or... They were the ones who was eager to talk to you, but you couldn't be bothered, okay? So let's see more. Yeah, passive-aggressive, or it could be somewhat aggressive. I don't know. Something about words. Coldness, again, Knight of Swords in reverse, Queen of Pentacles in reverse, Eight of Cups in reverse. Justice, let's see, another card that indicates something that was not right or something that was not equal. It wasn't being reciprocated. They could be feeling like you didn't reciprocate what they were trying to say to you or how they were trying to treat you. Like you didn't reciprocate their friendliness, their niceness towards you or vice versa. Or they, they feel like they shouldn't be reciprocating reciprocating your advances. It could go vice versa, yeah? I'm going to pull out a few of these Hidden Truths oracles. I can't stop thinking about you. So since they last saw you, they can't stop thinking about you. I think maybe because you were so cold towards them. Unless, again, it's vice versa. You came closer than anyone. Finding out the truth crushed me. It was my fault, but I blamed you. You were the best thing in my life. I wish I had treated you better. So it does feel like for a lot of you, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, this is like someone you have kind of disconnected from. The last time you saw each other, I think now they're realizing because maybe Six of Wands, maybe you've been cold towards them and then they feel like maybe you have already, you know, moved on and you're keeping your options open. Now they're starting to regret, right? Five of Cups, starting to feel bad about what they have said, what they have done. Maybe they should have treated you better here. Maybe they found out the truth about you just moving on from them and you came closer than anyone. So this is this could be somebody where, you know, either you were in a relationship with or was about to be in a relationship with, but then it just like, you know, suddenly in the tower, it's like there's an ending, something that was very unexpected. I'm going to pull out a few of these um lovers oracles Let's get some messages for you wait don't rush into it allow nature to take its course so some of you 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 may have been making this person wait or again treating them very coldly and you're not rushing into replying to the messages hence they could be feeling like okay maybe you have changed something that has changed about you Maybe it's because of the separation. But Spirit's definitely encouraging you to don't rush into this connection or don't rush into any connection at this moment. Just go with the flow. Allow nature to take its course. Some of you needs to hear it. 
We've got transformation. Your relationship with one another is about to deepen. Love conquers and transforms all things. For those of you currently in a relationship right now, maybe this the tower can indicate um an awakening. Your person or you could be awakened to the fact that, you know, um maybe it's time to transform this connection to change it. Turn it into something more. Change it into something more. High Priestess, sometimes I read it as a marriage card. Because I do remember re made, doing a personal reading for a friend. And then High Priestess came out as the last card, as the outcome. It, that was a different spread. as a Celtic cross spread. But, and I told them intuitively right away. I told them, I said, both of you are going to get married. It looks like that's a chance for both of you to get married. And they're married. They've been married for like six months now yep anyway pisces cancer and scorpio this is your reading and i hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below don't forget to hit on the bell notification button if you'd like to be notified every time when i post your videos and kindly subscribe to both of my channels chelsea love tarot and chelsea tarot 2.0 take care pisces cancer and scorpio hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow bye